Whatever. All right, so just by a real quick show of hands, how many of you guys really like pies? Apple pie specifically, like just apple pies? All right, great. So my favorite food of all time has to be apple pies, hands down. I like it like steaming hot in the morning with a big dollop of fresh whipped cream and like a giant bottle of Jose Cuervos, and that's like a great way to start the day for me. I love it. <laughs> and my favorite pie shop of all times is uh, Mom's Apple Pie. It's up on the way to Julian's, about 15 minutes west if you're taking the 76 East. And uh, one of like my most embarrassing and awkward stories happened at this pie shop. Uh, what happened was I came up to it, I walked in, and right behind the counter was this really, really cute girl. She was about like 5'7", brown hair, mousy face, like girl next door who also worked at a pie shop. So I was living the dream. <laughs> Uh, and she looked up at me and she seemed like not really taken aback, but like she made like a weird face at me for a second And then she went back to doing whatever she was doing at the cash register And I, I kind of wanted to strike up a conversation. So I was like, uh, sorry, what was that? And she said, oh, it's nothing. You just kind of look like my cousin is all but various childhood incidents and uh, a few injuries and a few other things that I probably shouldn't mention while on camera like, my, my hearing's not really what it used to be. So I had to ask again, uh, sorry, can you repeat that? And she said, oh, it's nothing. You look like my cousin. And, like, I should say right now that we're about, like, 20 feet from each other over an entire pie shop while we're having this conversation. And uh, I said, because apparently right then my brain decided to implode, and I forgot how exactly the English language and basic social interactions worked, I said, uh, yeah, because, you know, that like, a nor like what a normal person would say, when someone says that you look like their cousin, you say, yeah. And uh, there was a good, like, ten seconds of silence where neither of us really knew how to continue what was happening. So I decided to be proactive, and I walked up, and while saying as few words as possible, because apparently I don't know how words work, I asked for two pies. And then I drove about an hour and a half back to my house because also, apparently, I'm the kind of guy who likes to drive three hours for some apple pies and a really bad story. <laughs> Thank you.